Howdy, folks. Welcome back to the Alex Parker Road of the Show 622 PS5, episode 278. Oh, well, it's like my five, fifth episode of the day or something. Six games back on the range. It's not looking good, but we have won two in a row. That's positive. We are still playing Philly here. We've got Eduardo Carvajal on the mound. They've got Spencer Howard, but Eduardo has kind of been on a roll lately. Don't count Eduardo out. He could make something happen. He's 12 and 12 right now. And look at that. We're already up 2 nothing. That was really slow. Spencer Howard, did he not leave and come back? He did. He started with Philly and then traded in 2021. Texas, and then he's signed back with Philly now. He has not been good in his career at all. How is he throwing 635 innings? I have no clue. But, either way, it's 2 nothing. A wind in the pitch. That's down and two one. Well, he's so great about hitting the ball the other way. He gets those arms extended. So right there, on, just trying to straighten him up a little bit so he doesn't have as much outside play. That was disgusting. How did you throw that? There and the count is even. <laughs> Righty delivers. Not gonna touch that one. We'll touch that one. That and one's that absolutely launched. That curveball, so just a bit away. lower, but I had seen it before, so. It's not often someone Absolutely hits a knocked the cover off that ball. It's worthy of a stack They've got a single. Well, I was anxious to see what that exit v would be. And wow. And good double play from Chunky Monkey Bryson Stocks. Absolutely. Middle of the first. Now it's the cleanup hitter for the Phillies. Some trouble early. Ethan Wilson. Hey, this is one of those dudes who actually has developed like into a. Oh, no, he hasn't. Eh, he's been all right. 663 hits. Eh, I thought he was going to end up being pretty good for the uh, Phillies, but he's had a good year. That's for sure. On the ground. That's a quick toss and a double play. All right. A guy who makes an impact not just at the plate, but also in the field. Two down here. That's through. Let's go, baby. We are not going to the next bag, but it is a two RBI single. And the Angels are out in front. Six nothing here. Two RBI single for Alex. Pretty tough for the infielders to do anything with that one. He pulled it hard into the outfield. And even when you keep it on the ground, it feels great when you hit it. Two two, two down. Francisco Morales on a pitch here. Hasn't pitched in the last three days. 2-2, two, two, two down the pitch. It's oh, ball three. And outside. Not the easiest thing. They will be moving now. Talking about a guy that's, you know, perhaps is going to be in the rotation. You know, maybe a long relief guy to not start an inning, to come into an inning with pressure. Fred popped it up, and Bohm is going to get there. Makes the catch. Alec Bohm is still with the Phillies. The that's crazy. Bohm's a long-time Philly. Who, uh, kind of is okay i don't know i mean he gets a decent amount of hits he hit for a really high average in 2025 he's never hit below he's never hit below he hasn't hit below a 700 ops since 2021 and honestly uh, he's been solid i know his gloves not great it hasn't been that bad he's got a career war of 16.1 i ain't that bad wind of the pitch Looking up hot. Ground ball. Carvalho's got Throw to first seven outs, no runs. Lead off man retired here in the third. And here's the catcher, Rafael Marchand, known for his rocket arm behind the plate. Uh, all right. On the ground to the left. Parker. Alex is all over it. Two down. Yeah, they get the and on these you nights where I have to record so many videos in a row, four, it kind of sucks to be in and the season swing of things. I like being around postseason. Like, uh, the time I had to record for, what was it, Thanksgiving break? Some of them were 
uh, not some of them. A lot of them were playoff games, so that actually helped me a lot. On the ground to short, Parker. Or was it when I went to Sweden? I don't know. One of the two. But it was nice because those playoff episodes are a lot shorter. I'm more engaged. I am engaged right now, though. Don't get me wrong. How can you not be engaged when you're timing things and hitting pop-ups? Not really. I can't be mad. I've gotten two hits. 134 IBIs. That's crazy. Top of inning number seven. So now the angel cleanup hit. And Eduardo once again is absolutely dealing. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Eduardo has just figured it out lately. His past three or four starts have been yeah, really good. Detmers is probably going to hop in and take his spot back in the rotation. But I think Eduardo might have a future here in, a, in L.A. If he can figure it out. Uh, in the long term. And he's got good potential. I mean, I think he's going to go up to an 86 or an 87 Swing and a miss. this year. And we strike out. It right past him. This is Bryson's but, I mean, like today, he's already down to a 5-4-9. Good for him, man. Chunky Monkey Bryson Stott other way. is going to line out. All right. Three up, three. One down. Still 6 nothing. I wonder if he's still in. Eduardo's going to throw a shutout. We absolutely smoked it at the second baseman. Two for five. And yeah, 6 nothing. Eduardo throws a complete game shutout. Six Ks. Only two hits. Three walks. What is going on with Eduardo Carvajal? Maybe he is the chosen one. Carvajal's redemption arc, ladies and gentlemen. And welcome into the ballpark. Captain I'm going to miss this team if I leave. I mean, it is a terrible team sometimes, but they are fun to play with sometimes. I, I'm invested in a lot of these guys. Nice warm day here. Good baseball weather. Does that change but anything, Chris? Especially every story must come hitters. to an end. Absolutely, you feel so much more. And I want to compete, and this team is not competing. Jammed on fastballs inside in the future, the plate. I don't think. Uh, you could kind of be more selective instead of just looking out. Oh. Third out, and that ends the frame. Well, calls don't get much worse Those than that. Runner at first with two away. We've got Geo back on the mound. He's at a three-five-seven. Two and two. And there he goes. Up the middle, Bob handles. Just make the play nice. First, gets him easily, ends the inning. Start of the fourth. So in now for the Angels, Alex Parker. All right, Seth Corey. Yeah, that, that pitch definitely is a strike. Okay, Blue. The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. Ball. Hey, One ball. No strike. We're 12 hits away from another 200-hit season. That clips the corner. It's good speed at the top of the order here. You want to get Which it will on. Be nice. See if you can get a stolen base. Maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. Slap the other way. Foul. Foul ball. <sighs> the wind of the pitch. And now the count Almost is hit us. even. Seth Corey, dude, he does throw hard. He's tough to time. The wind to kick the pitch. Fouled off. He was yeah, like that ball seemed like it was humming well, in. A good fastball right there. Just couldn't catch up. And a pitch. Got him looking. Well, the hot dang. That is a pitch and a half, Seth. We have struck out three at bats in a row. Wow. Wow. Well, three out of our last four. And we never strike out. Down a run. Ground ball could be two. That is going to be a double play. Nicely done. So one out with two aboard. All right, two on. I mean, dang, that's a pitch. This guy wanted the best contact men in the sport as well. Outstanding on the defense. Well, I tried to catch up, and I'm too early. This guy absolutely flies. It has been a struggle. Wants to turn two, but they've got to get a ball they can do it with. Make sure you get the first out before you try to rush and get two. I can see that's a ball. Herrera on second. Fabra over at first with one away. 
Falling behind two All right, and one. Two one. Good spot for the hitter. Definitely has the advantage in this count with runners on. Look for him to be aggressive on this next two one. Pitch. Two and one now. Two aboard. I mean, dang man, what is going on with this dude? He is just finding the zone and the best spots. He did it again. That was disgusting. Ah, not as disgusting, but still a good pitch. But we scored two more. Wow, I struck out again. All right. Let's calm down and figure it out. We need a righty on the mound. Oh, here's Chunky Monkey Bryson Stott. He actually is fast. Even though he's fat. Look at him. Why is he so big? He is an oversized shortstop in this game. Yeah, well, I've struck out three times today. Not the fourth. We're going to fly out. Yes, sir. Wilson makes Not this time. Alex Parker, Two on. The next to hit for the Angels. Two down. As we are an out away. Or wait, three outs away. From a sweep on the Phillies. So we sweep. The A's get swept by the Braves. Tie their socks. Two outs. Two two, and then the sweep turn. the Phillies. No That's quite the, the way to it's quite Kevin the way to go. Bruce, the lead runner at second, Fabra, on at first with two down. Next offering is down low, so definitely a little wild right out of the gate. Well, it is three up from the bullpen mound to yeah, this swing, but you've got to find a way to get ahead in the count quickly. He has it. We'll see how this at bat turns out. No, I'm not ball for load the bases. Boog, do you think Another you walk could for Alex. Walk It'll be. If we gave you enough at bats. Oh, that's a good question. Now, Austin uh, Meadows, who's had quite the day, he's up to 93 RBIs. He's driven in a lot a lately. Scouting report on me. Yes, I think I could draw a walk. And the pitch just missed. Meadows probably second in the MVP voting right now. Two outs. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. Three, two. Oh, I forgot to go. That one down the line. And uh, oh, shot. wow. Just foul. That would have scored Good three. Battle here. About to be the eighth pitch of the at-bat. And that one fouled off. And he did it again. Not letting him get out of this easy. And Meadows is going to drive in three. It's 8 nothing, and the Angels first will for sure walk away with the win here. And they clear wow. That a boy, Austin. Run score, and it's an eight run lead. Really stayed true. Then at first, Ethan and it's going to be Geo on the mound. He's trying to get a complete game shutout. Back to back for the Angels, possibly here. On the ground, right side. Four. That's a good start. That's a 4 6 3 double play. And they turn the double play. Ball game. Eight nothing. Dang. And the road team picks Get up the win. smoked, Philly. Get smoked. That's what I'm talking about. All right. What are we, what are we rocking with? We are rocking with Toronto. Okay, and we're 11 games above 500. Have the Rangers started losing? Eh, kind of. I mean, we're four and a half back. And I mean, yeah, I definitely have. We're, we've caught them a game and a half, so. That's nice. And we are should be. Yeah, we're on top of the freaking wild card now. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's get into this. Toronto, Jose Barrios, Vladdy. No more Max there, but that's fine. It's uh, it's still a really good team. They have the second best record in the AL. The Royals own the best, shockingly. Just about ready to roll here. And pitching in this game, Jose Barrios. But Chris Barrios is, is kind of filthy. But he's probably had a great career. He came up young, man. Yeah, he came up really young. Yeah, he's thrown 2,230 innings. He's got 2K strikeouts. 
Yeah, Jose has been an elite pitcher for a while. Great career. Did not perform well last year, though, in real life. He wants to be more effective here. So, you know, you look at the numbers. They haven't been great at home. I'm sure he wants to turn that around. Deep right center. And it's going to get down. Meadows. With a relay throw. He ends. Nice, he is. All right, we hold the run. The throw from going to home. And it's 5-1 to one now. Great job, Matt Brash. We have a chance to get back in it, though. And that's a hit. Hold, Vavra. Nice, nice, nice. Bases are juiced now. Good job, Alex. So now here's the deal. It'll be Nick Gordon, who singled in his last at bat. One for one with a single so far. He broke his bat. He'll get Gordon, but it's going to score run. Two are still in scoring position. All right, that's not the worst outcome. Come on, Frederick. Base it would be delightful. Foul ball. Next one and it's 3 2. And it's 3 and 2. Meadows on third. Parker over at second with one down. And a uh, Come and on. Two away. So two down you now. Bum. And here is you just have to fly it out. Grounded out his first time. The next pitch misses. Matthew Barefoot. With Drew Romo on deck. Barefoot, I believe, has been back to his, his old ways of sucking ever since he came back from injury. No, he hasn't, actually. He's up to 256. So maybe he isn't the king of suck anymore. He is in with risk, though. We're only getting one. And next for Toronto, Brian Chu for the fourth time tonight. What happened? Like, yeah, Brash just got smoked. The second baseman, Ryan Chu. Ground ball right side could be chopped it. Off balance could be Chu. Dang it. In time at first, it's a fielder's choice. Shot like that pun. That was pretty funny. Alex Parker, the next to hit for the Angels. Singled last time. First offering misses the mark. If you're the mound right now, you know you have to retire this hitter. If he gets on base, it could open up the floodgates for this offense to score some yeah, runs. That's well inside. So two nothing, or two zero. Still down three. Now trailing by two is Alex almost killed Jose. Nice. Five three. Well, patience and discipline paid off right there. As he so got that's a couple of RBIs on the day for Alex. It feels like you're swinging an aluminum bat. It jumped off so hard, squared it up, and it went screaming. They go to the pitch out. Miles per hour. And now they've got some speed on first. So that's we'll like a superpower to get those. Tying run at the plate. Run around the goal. That's in for a strike. Throw. Like, you, you draw a pitch and out. It's an immediate late. ball. See, he definitely showed off the wheels there. Yeah, and it turned out to be a bang, it's nice. bang two, play. Two. Statcast gives us the data, and that stolen base wasn't possible without that sprint speed. And to that right, we will hold. We would be toast. Stop sign goes up at third. Yeah, we would have been toast. Freddie, please don't choke and again. He's LA. over two. But they pop out to the catcher and a strikeout, and he swung at that. He's looking for a ground what a doofus! A Absolute doofus. At the belt and fires. And another ball. Activity in the bullpen. Ryan Barucki, the left hand. Yeah, the last thing we need to double play. A fly ball would be fine. Newcomb, oh my gosh, I thought that was strike three. Pitch is outside. Three, two. And a Freddy, you piece of strike out there. So in now for the Angels, Matthew Barefoot. I don't want to cuss. You piece of. Poopy doopy. 
<sighs> Freddy is so bad, man. Stays and Barefoot alive. doesn't hit with Risp. Like, Runner ever. Ever. Third, He's like 180 with runners in scoring position this year. Like, come through, Matthew. Please. Like a base hit. Gosh, man. Our catcher sucks. Our third baseman is awful. Rios check to first. Gord back in standing. <sighs> and a swing and a miss. Tosses the first. Holy cow, that's twice we've had runners on and we strike out twice. In a row. Alex Parker. Year in and We're year three out, for this three. Guy, an MVP candidate. Next pitch downstairs. Ball one. Come on, dude. Bomber deals. In for a strike. And a count one and one. He's trying to stay away from this lefty, knowing that a lot of left handers like the ball down and in. Kicks and deals. Off the mark there. And a count two and one. Now you get to this two part one. of the order. Yeah, there's some pop there, but more likely there's some base hits. Nope. That's, so very important wow, that's the that's worst that's call of all time. Holy cow. It helps us. That one and then we go deep, so. Oh, we don't go deep. I'm sorry. I, I, I apologize. I was completely wrong. We fly out. Back now in Toronto. Stepping in, Brian Chu. Leading up for Toronto. The second baseman. Slow roller up the middle. Play it. Parker collects it. On the run, sends it over to first. Oh, man. One gone to the bottom of the eight. A 5-3 foul score. In 13 score. hits, and we only muster, thir er, we only muster three runs. That's impressively bad and frustrating. And I hate Freddie Freeman and Matthew Barefoot for choking so hard. I have Luis Garcia. I'm so glad I'm not leading off and have to watch you wind up. One nothing. Now yep, I called it. He can't get there. It's a base hit. Trap. And I'll take Down second while I'm at it. He will score and they One out double. The One nothing. Now, no waiting around right there. He was ready to double number thirty four. I love the approach he had right there with that pitch. Not trying to do too oh. much, but still looking to drive oh. it. Oh, oh, that's exactly what he's able to do into the opposite oh, field. That's a bad throw too. In Lucky there, JD safely. stopped it, and now. All we need is a fly out. Parker. And he won there. I trust Meadows is going to get this done, though. Meadows is not Freddie Freeman or Matthew Barefoot. Meth Meadows has 96 RBIs this year. He's about to get 97. And you know why he is? Because he's a decent hitter with risp. Please don't prove me wrong, Meadows. Oh, my gosh. That's out number two. Just a hammer, 12-6 curveball right there, Boog. That was uh, this team is like atrocious sometimes. Throw a true 12-6 break, but he does, and you can't throw it any better than he did. The object of the game is to get the runs across the plate, not just to get the hits, guys. Okay, okay, okay. Righty to the plate, and he walked him. Walk scored him. Might as well call it an inning. Matthew Barefoot stepping up. And there are runners in scoring position. Just let him miss one more. And he one to the right oh, side. Well, he, at least he made He'll contact this time. We take a one nothing lead off an Alex Parker double. Two outs, nobody on. Digging in, Alex Parker. The like Here you go. Alex Parker. one back up the middle. Throws to first, and that will end the inning. <sighs> Base is empty, one away. Alex Parker digs in now. Alex 
Parker. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Oh, one. One down, base is empty. In I hate that for myself. As I time that one on a almost perfect basis, and we hit a routine flavor. Routine flavor. This is my fringe accent. No way. I played so much of this game. I'm so tired of this. I have like two more to play, dude. Ah, uh, it's two to two. This guy is one of the best athletes in the sport. That one's in there on one. You know, this guy's great speed is in the back of that pitcher's mind. If he can get on, it's going to give him one more thing he's got to think about. The pitch. Strike two. Well, hot dang, Daniel Norris. If you throw one more on that outside corner, I might just have to string you up by the feet. What is going on? Yeah, I <laughs> well, he missed badly with that 0-2 fastball. Hitter has to understand. Probably wants to try to put him away with that pitch. So got to stay ready for it. Oh, he almost did it. <laughs> he came close. And the pitch. Hey, that's a hit. Nice outs. Well, that at bat had a lot of pressure riding on it, so really great oh, job coming through right there. It's got to feel good. Couldn't get any air under it, but he smoked that ball back up. Come on, Meadows. Just perfect. Got great peace. Rudder takes off. Hey, what did he do? They get one. And the throws off line. Nice. All right. We take third. Nick Gordon. The Here's Nick Gordon. Man, we could have this if Meadows would just come through for once. And downstairs, moving in the Blue Jays bullpen, Ryan Barucki getting ready to go. If we don't score here, we're blowing this in the night. Um, we are not scoring here. That's in play. Moreno makes the catch, and that'll do it. Well, we did blow it, but we have a two down. Runner on second. I hate Ryan Barucki. I never hit this dude. Well, we're one for two, but still. Maybe I'm thinking of something different. What the? be quiet out there. Not bouncing around. Not distracting your teammate, the hitter. Make sure that he can clearly focus on that pitcher and that release point. The old one is outside, and it's a ball and a strike. Two down. Go ahead, run and score in position. That's good pitch. I I gotta hit that. I just I can't. I can't right now. How's that? How's that? How's that? How's that? Let's freaking go! Let's freaking go! Oh shoot! Ah oh, shoot! It's our. How does he make that throw? Just saying. I hate this team so much. What do you even do? <sighs> Whatever. They're five and a half now because we've lost two straight. That we shouldn't have lost, especially that one. Ryan Weathers blows another save. How many is that? How many is that, Ryan? Seven out of 43, bro. Holy cow. Five on three ERA. You, you, sir, are a bad, bad pitcher. Now, Eduardo, on the other hand, is a baller. This dude in his last three or something has given up like two runs. Jaime Barilla's back at the big league level. Put him in, goodness. I don't know why he wasn't at the big league level. Anyway, he's been great for us. Griffin Canning's been fine. I mean, like, he was really good last year. But better this year. Reed's coming back. That's Actually, no, he's not. I don't know. Patrick Sandoval is 
awful. Matt Brash is awful. Giolito is literally the same Lucas Giolito we've seen the last many years. Yeah, he's fine. What's Eduardo's war at? Because he's kind of won us the last couple. It's 0.6 this year. I feel like he's delivering some good pitches. I'm an Eduardo believer. If you liked the video, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. That's it for me. That's Alex Parker, episode 278.